Smash Mouth football is more Coach Pete Kittle's style. So when he had to go to the air and count on big plays, he got a little nervous. It's hard to imagine, but we do practice throwing the ball all the time. We just haven't had a lot of games to uh, to try to take advantage of that, and I'm kind of conservative and a little bit afraid of some things that can happen when you throw that ball around. But um, I, I had a lot of confidence in our passing game and that we could make some plays if we needed to. 121 yards and two touchdowns came courtesy of the pass and helped contribute to Brilliant's first state championship since 2004. Tonight we just had the opportunity to throw more because they stopped our run, and or for the most part, I mean, not as much as we normally have. But uh, we just had to, sometimes we had to go to our pass, and it worked tonight. Brilliant's big win came without senior running back Tanner Banky, who has rushed more than 600 yards in the postseason. Banky left the game with a shin strain. It was pretty disappointing, but I'm glad the people that went in, they felt in great and did a great job, so it made it a little easier. Regardless of what happened on the field, it's the feeling afterward that will stick with the Lions for a lifetime. Oh, well, it's awesome. Anytime you get, I told our kids coming here, you don't realize how, how lucky we are to be in this situation. I don't even know how to explain it. It's it's amazing. I mean, state championship, it, I mean, there's only four teams in Brilliant that have done that in football, and I get a chance to be part of one. It's amazing. At Camp Randall Stadium, Paige Pearson, Fox 11 Sports.